Home office, more than just a place. Hello, everyone. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of English phrases, specifically the term home office. This phrase is not just about a physical space but carries various meanings in different contexts. So, whether you're learning English for work, study, or just for fun, understanding such phrases is incredibly useful. Let's explore what home office means and how you can use it in everyday conversations. When we break down the term home office, it seems quite straightforward. Home is a place where someone lives, and an office is a place where people work. So, a home office refers to a workspace located within someone's residence. With the rise of remote work, this term has become increasingly common. It's a space where you can focus on work tasks without the formal setting of a traditional office. In today's world, Home office often refers to the concept of working from home or telecommuting. When someone says, I'm working from my home office today, they mean they are doing their job from home, not in their company's physical office. This phrase encapsulates the flexibility and the blurred lines between personal and professional life in the modern work culture. Interestingly, Home office is also a specific government department in the United Kingdom. It's responsible for immigration, security, and law and order. So, in a British context, if someone mentions the home office, they might be referring to this government department, not a workspace in someone's house. Let's see how to use this phrase in sentences. 1. Literal sense. I renovated the spare room into a home office. 2. Remote work. My company allows me to work from my home office twice a week. 3. Governmental term. The home office announced new visa regulations. Notice the difference in context, which changes the meaning of the phrase. And that's a wrap on home office. It's a phrase with multiple meanings each relevant in different scenarios. Understanding such phrases enriches your English comprehension and makes you a more versatile communicator. I hope this video has been enlightening and helpful. Keep practicing, and see you in our next language adventure.